Good evening. I'd like to talk about reading metric vernier micrometer with 2000 millimeter resolution. In this micrometer, we have three scales instead of two scales. The first scale is this scale, which shows the whole millimeter and half millimeters. And we have the second scale, which is the 50 graduations at the front of the thimble. And we have a third scale. In the below photo, we have the vernier scale. As you see here, we have a vernier with five equal divisions. So in this case, we say that the resolution of this micrometer is simply 0.002 mm. Let's first understand how to read the three scales. Let's start with reading the sleeve scales. This is the sleeve scales, and this scale represents the whole millimeters and half millimeters. As you see here, the way how to read this line is very simple. This is the line number 0 mm. This is line 0 0.5 mm. This line is 1 mm. 1.5 mm, 7 mm, 12.5 mm, 16 mm, and this is the last line, which is line number 25. So this is the way how to read the lines on the main scale in the whole mm and half mm. Let's understand how to read the thimble scale, as we know for the metric micrometer, the thimble scale contains 50 equal graduations. So this line is line number 27. So it is read as 0 0.27 mm. This line is 0 0.28 mm, 0 0.29, 0 0.32, 0 0.33, 0 0.34 etc so this is the way how to read the scale or the graduations in the thimble scale finally we need to know how to read the vernier scale as you see here the vernier scale is simply five equal divisions and the way how to read these lines is simple for example this line represents the 0 0.0000 mm this line is 0 0.002 mm this line is 0 0.004 mm 0 0.006 mm 0 0.008 mm and this is 0 0.000 mm as you see this is the way how to read the lines of the vernier scale how to read the scale simply the vernier includes five lines one of the five lines should line up with one of the thimble scale so in this photo as you see here this line line up with this line so this line is simply it is 0.004 mm so the reading of the vernier scale for this micrometer is simply 0.004 mm okay let's understand how to read the total reading for this micrometer let's start first with the the main scale on the sleeve Let's read the whole millimeters and half millimeters. As you see, the last line appears here. Before the edge of the thimble is this line, and this line is simply line number 5.5 mm. So the sleeve reading is simply 5.5 mm. Then we need to read the thimble scale or the 50 graduations. As you see, here we consider this line to be the reference 
or the index line. The reference line lies between these two lines on the thimble scale. This line is line number 28 and this line is line number 29. So we should take the lower line, which is line number 28. Actually, we take the reading of this line because the distance between this line and the reference line is simply the vernier reading. So the thimble reading is 0 0.28 mm. The third reading, as you see in the photo below, as I have said, we have five graduations for the vernier. One of these five lines should line up with one of the 50 graduation on the thimble scale. As you see here, this line on the vernier scale lines up with this line on the thimble scale. So we should read line number four. So it is 0.004 mm. Now we can simply as sum up all of these three readings. So the total reading is simply is the sum up of these three values. The first value is 5.5. See that we add to zero because the final reading for this micrometer contains three decimal points. And this is the reading of the thimble scale. So we add zero right to the eight in order to have three decimal places. And this is the reading of the vernier scale. So the total is 5.784 mm. Let's take this question. As you see, the left photo shows the scale of the whole mm and half mm. So the last line appear in this scale is this line. And this line is simply 5.5 mm. So the sleeve reading is simply 5.5. It is better to add two zeros right to the five because the resolution of this micrometer is simply with three decimal places. So this is the sleeve reading. Now we should read the thimble scale reading. So this is the reference line. This reference line lies between this line, line number 29, and this line number 30. So we should read the lower line, and the lower line is simply, it is 0 0.29. So the thimble reading is 0 0.29, and we should add here 0 to have three decimal places. Now we should lastly read the vernier reading. As you see the photo to the right, as you see one of the five vernier lines should lines up with one of the thimble scale. As you see this line on the vernier scale lines up with line number 40. We are interested on the line on the vernier. So we have 0 0.006 mm. Now simply we can get the total reading by summing up all of these values. So we have here 6, we have here 9, we have here 7, and the whole millimeter we have five millimeter. So the total reading is five and seven nine six thousandths of the millimeter. Let's have this last question. The sleeve reading is simply this line. This line is the last line on the main scale. 
before the edge of the thimble. So this line is simply line number 10.5. So the sleeve reading is 10.5. Again, we should add two zeros right to the 5. Regarding the thimble reading, this is the reference line. This reference line lies between line number 34 and line number 35. So we should read the lower one. So we should read the line number 34. So it is 0 0.34. And let's add zero right to the four so this is the thimble reading and finally we should read the vernier scale the photo to the right shows the vernier scale clearly so as you see here this line on the vernier scale lies up with this line on the thimble scale so this line on the vernier scale is simply 0 0.0004 mm. So the whole reading is simply is the adding up of these three values. So the total reading, here we have 4, and here we have another 4. Here we have 8, and we have 10 millimeters. So the total reading is simply 10.844 mm. That's how the way how to read the metric vernier micrometer. Thanks for your watching. Goodbye.